Have you ever wondered about the fascinating history behind the first tycoon game on Roblox? What motivated its creator? And how did the trend of similar tycoon games form? Join me on this journey as we reveal the answers to these questions and explore the evolution of tycoon games on Roblox. One year after the release of Roblox in the year 2007, a game named Bread Factory Tycoon emerged. While it may not be in your interest, this game took the community by storm, having an impressive 500,000 visits and players being one of the top Roblox games for a span of four months. The game's popularity can be attributed in part to its creator, a well-known developer known as Aburubert. The creator behind Bread Factory Tycoon would go on to make numerous games after this. However, as is common among many dedicated Roblox players, he eventually left the platform due to a failure to adapt to a significant Roblox update that broke his Tycoon games and was soon terminated in 2016. Following this event, a new trend emerged as he unco-piloted his Tycoon game for others to utilize, spawning thousands of Tycoon games created by different Roblox developers. This open sourcing approach contributed significantly to the surge in Tycoon game release. Fast forward to 2011, and new simulator games began to emerge, causing Bread Factory Tycoon-based games to gradually lose traction. Who knew this would mark a five-year decline in the tycoon genre? It wasn't long before tycoon games made a comeback in 2016, but in a different form. Many tycoon games during this period were clickbait or fake tycoons that would often teleport players to obbies or contain no actual tycoon. Gameplay. Their titles often are based on popular themes, such as fast food chains or popular YouTubers. These games would have more dislikes than likes. Although the fake tycoons stain the genre's reputation, it is important to note that not all tycoon games fall into this category. In recent times, there are some unique and enjoyable tycoon games that have successfully captured the interest of players. This proves that the genre still holds potential for creativity. If you enjoyed this video, I would appreciate it if you leave a like and subscribe. If you have any suggestions, comment.